having a bit of audio problem there. <laughs> okay. So uh, I changed the name of the YouTube channel. The reason why I did that is because I had two channels and this one seemed like it was doing better. So yeah, we changed this one over and by me changing this one over I might lose a few subscribers because this this channel was completely different to the other one. But anyway, <coughs> we've got a game. <laughs> Let's jump into it. We're going to play some Fishing Planet. We're playing on PC today. We do play console as well. But today we're going to play PC. since I've done this because I've been busy been busy with this channel and making some edits and doing other bits and pieces and yeah so been quite busy but <clears throat> oh, we're loading up I should have really started the loading before I did this Yeah, it's been a little, been a little bit of time since, since I've actually managed to play the game because I've had to edit different videos and stuff. And on the other channel, I think we had um, just over, just over 500 videos on there, including live streams as well. And I got to transfer them all over, but I just picked a few. I didn't get not that many. <laughs> and the reason, the reason I didn't. Is because it would it would just be too long. 
it would take it would t well there's so many people here I don't know let's let me get out of the way <laughs> wow okay um new friends only room that's what we're doing how's it going game boys good to see you again man It's loading. It's a little bit on the slow side today, I've got to be honest. Well, I put it as this name. <laughs> the other one. The other one was okay, but the underscore was a little bit of a pain to some people. Because some people don't... Even though some people are proper high tech with computers, some people are not. And me saying bubbles underscore my way all the time, some people don't understand that. They don't understand the underscore. So, yeah, I just decided to do it as bubbles way. It's still pretty, I, I am going to miss the other, the other YouTube account. This one definitely has a lot more subscribers. So, um, yeah, that's the only reason why I went with it. Because I, I, didn't, I didn't know which one to go with. I kept uploading on the other one a lot, and I don't know if I ever actually even spoke about this channel, but this channel was called, obviously, it wasn't called Bubbles Way, it was called something else. So, we're pretty much starting this one from fresh now, this, this YouTube. <laughs> Not completely fresh, because obviously there is subscribers here, but because there's more here than the other one, makes me want to... Makes me want to work harder on this one. It seems like that this one's done a little bit better. The other one, it was like 1.34 subscribers. And this one's 3.13. So I've already lost subscribers already. I did have 3.16. So I have lost a few. But that's because the content is completely different. <laughs> so the content that I used to used to do compared to the content of the other channel the yeah, the the complete opposite but hopefully today <clears throat> the plan is to pull in some of those monster tarpon that's the, that's the plan where it's going to work, I don't know, but that's the plan. It normally works out pretty good. <coughs> okay, yeah, so just to mention for all those people that haven't actually seen us live stream here before. Anytime there is updates on Fishing Planet, we're going to download, install as quick as we possibly can my internet speed is really fast so it will not take me very long but as soon as we get updates we will be yeah we'll be live streaming straight away we'll be giving you giving you guys all the great content showing you where everything is there we go yeah we're going to be showing you where good fishing spots are all the new stuff dlcs all the good stuff of, of the actual game we do play other games on the channel as well, but this is probably the main the main game that we are going to be playing. But as I say, when new games come out as well, like I will be doing that, and we will be doing some new games. We got some. Um, what was it? It was Snow Runner. We got I brought Snow Runner because um, Big Man was was playing it. And it looked pretty good. He did a share play with me. So we brought that. And I didn't know whether to do some Fishing Planet or whether to do Snow Runner. So here we are. We're doing we're doing this. <laughs> but I might do I might do Snow Runner as well. Like I will definitely have some uploads of Snow Runner. But I mean I might I might do a live stream on it. I don't know when that will be. It could be later on today. It could be 
It could be a week, it could be a month, I have no idea. But yeah, we will we will have maybe a live stream of that. Okay, so we're out to get them big tarpons. So far we're catching tarpons, so we're on the right tracks. <clears throat> it's gonna be very expensive when I come out of this place. To repair to repair all my stuff. It's not gonna be cheap. Okay, common snook. Nice. Not very big, but it'll do the job. Yeah, we've earned some serious money. Look at that, I'm on day 52. And we've got, how much do I have? Um, I, don't even, I don't even know, actually. I think it's like just over 500,000. 543, wow, nice. But yeah, look at my net. My net needs to be repaired, the jacket, the rod bag, the normal bag. So, <laughs> I'm guessing it's gonna cost, um, and not not just that, but all the rods as well. So, mm, it's probably going to be over two hundred thousand cash, I reckon. It's not going to be cheap. Another permit. So yeah, the update for the Fishing Planet update for the Amazon Lake that was meant to be. That was meant to be last week. <laughs> it got delayed, which was um, really unfortunate because me having that new content right now it would be would be really good. But but when I say delayed, like they didn't they they said that it was coming that week, and it didn't come that week. And then somebody else, again, I don't know if this is true, somebody else ended up saying that it was going to be two weeks, in like two weeks from last week, but I don't know. That's not, that's not what Fishing Planet said, that's just what somebody said on the, on the forums. When it, when people say stuff like that, sometimes, sometimes they do tell the truth, but then sometimes people do tell... I don't know why, but they tell lies about it. <laughs> they do. <clears throat> this is gonna be a good, good permit. This one's really going for it. Well, forty pounds permit. Sorry, I should have showed that a little bit longer. Yeah, it's a bit, that was a bit of a fight, that one. I still haven't fixed that glitch then. So yeah, I think I pulled over about eight, eight Fishing Planet videos from the other channel. And I think it was seven or eight. And then I, I pulled over one Moto blog that we did. And they weren't the they weren't the highest amount of views videos. There was probably some of the lower ones, but they were just ones that I thought that took me a long time to make those videos. It didn't get load of views or anything like that, which compared to some of the other compared to some of the other videos that we make anyway. But I don't really mind it too much because, as I say. I spent a long time editing those videos. Some of the other videos I made I didn't edit for nowhere near as long and obviously they got a lot more views and stuff but them ones to me took a very long time so it, it makes it important to me. <laughs> but yeah, only, only about eight I think I brought over in total. I picked up the wrong rod there. But if I if I transferred every single one of them, I wouldn't be live streaming for a long time, and I doubt doubt I'll be uploading any videos because I would just be, I'd just be doing that. And I could say on this channel, I could have said on this channel, 
about checking out the other one, but yeah, there's no point. I ended up shutting it down. I took off a few videos that I wanted and then I shut it down. So that no longer exists. This is the this is gonna be the new channel. This is a good size fish, this one. I don't know how big. Whoa, that looks like a good size. Uh, not as big as I thought, but still big fish though. 73 pounds and a half. Also, to mention as well, also caught my my new biggest fish. It was my new big, my newest, no, what was it? Yeah, no. I had, oh my God, my brain's all over the place. It was 147 pound. And then I ended up catching one that was just over 148 pound. It wasn't by a lot, but still an extra pound bigger than my biggest size fish. That that would have been a long, long video. I have got an upload of that on this channel. But yeah, I think I I think I was fighting it for around about 20 minutes real time. <clears throat> and instead of that, I just cut it right down, and I think I made it about two minutes. It wasn't very, it wasn't very long at all. Just because of them long videos, watching you fight. Some people like to see that. <clears throat> yeah, some people like to see um, you fighting the fish for ages, and some people don't. I think is what I will do for this channel. Like I am going to be doing live streams. I'm not going to do what I did on the other one and live stream every day. Not just yet. Because the channel is going to be slow. There's not going to be many viewers watching me live. I have notified a few people who were subscribed to the other channel. I have notified maybe around about 10, maybe 15 at the most. So I have notified a few people that we are changing over to the channel. So we will have a few coming in. But I'm going to quickly get some tissue. I didn't really need to blow my nose. I was like going to keep on sniffling. Now I can actually talk. Now I can talk properly. <laughs> yeah, so I'm, I am going to be live streaming on here, but not every single day, not just yet. Eventually I will do it as we live stream every day, but at the moment I am going to, I'm going to concentrate on making videos just so we get more people watching us live rather than them keep coming back to it all the time or us not me us not getting many views there and it's not all about views but I do like to have an audience I don't I don't like to have too many <laughs> just because it, it's hard to try and catch up with every what everyone said I guess over time I, there's you know when you get so many people watching When so many people watch, you're not going to be able to get every single comment. So I don't mind having like 10, 20 people. That's pretty cool. Because I, I'm able to read chat like that. But then when, when there gets more, like there have been, I don't always catch every comment. And I do try. But yeah, when there's a lot of people, it is hard to try and read all, all of the chat. So that's one good thing about people not having too many viewers. And obviously not having insane amount of subscribers is you manage to I think you can definitely interact with your chat a lot more whereas if when you got loads of people talking and you got loads of people watching mm, yeah you, you can't it's impossible you can't read every comment so yeah we will be doing live streams here and there but I'm gonna concentrate on the videos Keep making the videos. 
and then once uh, once I do a live stream every now and again and then once I start seeing an increase on more people watching us whilst we're live and then and then I will increase the the live streams but I, I need to make a lot of great content <laughs> Just because on this on this channel, there's literally the only videos that are on there, are the ones that I put on early hours this morning. <clears throat> so this channel does look a little bit dead at the minute. big tarpon to come in I think on a sunny day will probably be the better day I look like a permit there I'm sure that's permit going on to that rod I could I could be I could be wrong but it did look like it oh wow it's not okay that that looks big as well unfortunately and this reel is not very good. This reel that I got on here, I needed to, I needed to buy another reel for this rod. And I was, I got away with it for so long, using this this reel. But I don't, I don't think I'm going to be able to. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be able to now. I thought to myself, if I catch a big fish with this reel, it's not going to be easy. And unfortunately we did. Well not unfortunately, it's always good to catch, but yeah, it's um Oh well wow, that reeled in really good there. It's swimming towards me. Yeah. A few people have mentioned actually about saying about how I stop it from running. As long as you've got the right reel and the right rod, or at least half a decent reel, keep your finger on the strike button all the time. And don't reel. If you don't reel, then it won't let line out. That is so close, it's literally touching my foot. There we go. Whoa, 136 pound. I said, see, no clickbait here. <laughs> Fishing planet monster tarpon. There's a monster. We have obviously had bigger, but it's still nice to still nice to catch them big fish. So I don't think I got anyone online. No, no one's online. So we're gonna be fishing alone. That's all right though. Mm. Yeah, we'll get set back up. I was thinking about jumping to the next day, but it's not actually been too bad. <clears throat> so I'll show you the setup on this rod. Um, oh no, actually I should. Actually, on the, I can just show you all of them. I don't need to keep it in my hand. Just so that way you guys, if you want to get the same rod and reel, you can. That one there is probably not the very best reel. So that's the light. The light. Okay. Hold on. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, that's the light bell. So ignore that rod. But I will show you the rest of the setups. And... If you want to get the same setups to catch some of these big tarp and the setup that I'm using works absolutely perfect. So I'll quickly show you. And that rod and reel, that works really good. I've had some monster tarping with that as well. Okay, this rod is the one I got in my hand now. So this reel, this reel is a perfect combination for this rod. And as you can see there, we're using the mono leader. Oh, the titanium leader, I've used it. You definitely don't catch nowhere near as much tarpon, so mono leader is a must. Definitely a must. 
that then obviously the, the large minnows but yeah you can always pause it if you wanted to get the same setup I'll show you where we are on the map as well just in case no one just in case anybody hasn't seen where we are fishing but it is quite a popular location we did show it on the other on the other channel that we had but up there is where you start and then just drive down here in a boat and this is where we are but if you don't have a boat you can rent a kayak so that's one good thing it's just very very slow it's very slow coming down though it does take a long time I might actually take this reel off I think I'm gonna it's not a very good one Like it does the job. I will show you what reel that is. Just in case if you're not a high enough level to get the better reels. You can get that reel. Which is a not as good reel as the other ones. But it still it still works. So it's a Giffen Spod. 1,000. 100,000. 10,000. <laughs> okay. Let me. Yeah. I'll show you the, the other reel. It was cast reels. And that was on. Spin reel, there we go. So I tried using this one, the 6000, and it wasn't, it wasn't as good. It was, yeah, it definitely wasn't as good. So these are the ones I'm using at the minute. But I'm going to buy this one, because this one's pretty, pretty good as well. That works, I think it works really good on this rod. Okay, we've got a, oh nice, I didn't even have to, didn't even have to change the leader over or reset the hook or nothing awesome. Oh uh, wow. I bet this one does the same. <laughs> this game. This game. Wow. Yeah, hopefully we get a, um, I'm pretty sure that the second best reel, which we just brought, is is the better one. Because when I brought the best reel, it seemed like it was too good for the rod. Like it actually put damage on the rod when I max out the reel. I like to max out the reel because it makes it a lot easier trying to control the fish. I, I definitely like to max out every reel on certain rods. Keep them always maxed and then that way you know that it can't break. And okay, so that's on the is that the light green one? Yeah, okay. So I'm gonna rem remember that's on the light green one because these ones are the 4000. Let me get the light green one. I think it was that one. There you go. We got it right now. Okay, so we're gonna set this one up, and I'm gonna keep this one on the left, on the on the top all the time. I'm not gonna keep it like halfway actually, just for the moment. But I am very, I'm very sure because obviously we play on console as well as PC. I'm on PC right now, but when we play on console, we, I'm pretty sure I got the five thousand reels. On all of the heavy chases that I use. Just to mention as well, if you are on console, you are on PC, you are more than welcome to add us. I like to play with random people to see what other people can catch, see how fast they're catching, see what kind of techniques they use. And I was meant to go to the next day and I completely forgot. That's alright. We'll fish here for a little bit. Until we get a couple more, and then, and then we'll go to the next day. Just so that way it keeps a fast pace. That's one thing I've noticed about the game. As long as you keep skipping forward quite a bit, you do catch at a fast pace. Especially if you're fishing peak times, which is definitely a good thing to do, but it's not very often I do that. 
<laughs> I normally just get in and I start fishing unless I'm going for a, a certain fish and I can't catch it at any time and then I will fish that peak time otherwise otherwise I normally just fish any time morning I always start from morning fish through And on this one we got the net that's 881 pound whereas if on the on the other account we got the one that's just over a thousand we could buy the better net but it's so expensive at the minute <laughs> just because I'm it's gonna cost me so much to repair these rods I don't think the rods are gonna be the most expensive thing to do but the definitely definitely that net for sure that net is not going to be cheap right. I just feel like if I spend any more time there on that day it's not gonna it's not gonna be good so it does slow down when you get a little bit further on I think anything after like 630 to 7 it does slow down quite a bit. You can catch these tarpon in the, in the evening time as well. Like 6 p.m. On, onwards, so I've, I've caught them. But as I say, I normally just start the day from 5 o'clock. That's, that's the time that you start. The game is free as well, just to mention for anyone who's never seen the game. It's free across all platforms. Unfortunately, they don't let you cross platform, which is a shame. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I can max out this reel. I didn't get a chance to do it because that fish wasn't that big. So I'm going to leave the tension up a little bit more. As this, the reason why I'm doing what I'm doing is just in case I did get it wrong. Because... If that's too strong, that reel that I got on there, it put damage on the onto the rod. I'm very sure it was that one, but just in case it wasn't, take the tension lower, then gradually we'll increase it. By doing that, we won't snap our line and leader, and we won't damage the rod as well. <clears throat> I thought uh, I was actually thinking bait. That's why I cast there. <laughs> Do that again. Yeah, this popper, hopefully I can catch. I will catch. Well, we already have caught some tarpon, but I'm hoping I can catch a big one on, on here just to show you guys. But this popper is absolutely awesome. There we go. On this reel as well. This is the best reel you can get. And this is the best spinning rod you can get. 43 pounds. Nice. There you go. We got some interest there. Hopefully it doesn't come off again. Nice. So I think, yeah, I think we can max it out. Yeah, there we go. So this is probably the best combination for the for this heavy chaser rod. There you go, unique. I can't show it too long just because we've got another fish on. So yeah, that 5,000 works absolutely amazing with that one. This is a good one. Right, there's only a permit. I'm trying to speed reel. I will show you show you the fish, but if I have another fish on, I can't show I can't show it very long just because I don't want to miss the next one. Get another permit. Yeah, if we don't have a fish on her, then obviously I will show you it a little bit longer. One thing to mention: catching these fish. It's definitely a good way to level up. Definitely an awesome way to get a serious amount of cash. As you can see, I've got over 500,000 cash. So, yeah, definitely a good way to get cash. 
definitely a really good way for XP. But they do batter your stuff. <laughs> they do seriously batter your gear. Your gear gets really damaged, so you, uh, you do have to do have to spend a lot of money trying to repair stuff in the in the future anyway once you've fished here as you can see we've done 53 days and I've got over half, over half a durability left on the rods it would probably be less than that the reason why it's more is because I do jump days so I jump forward days and as well as jumping forward on days I also skip time quite a lot rainy days I don't bother to fish you can catch on a rainy day but it's just really really slow going so yeah I, I do jump forward because sometimes you get two or three days I also jump forward as well and don't always fill my net just because I want to keep the stream entertaining so that way there's not too much downtime so that way we keep catching fish non-stop So this place here, this this location on a sunny day is a really nice, really nice little spot. You could also fish over there to the left, just round over there where we parked the boat up. Over there is pretty nice. But over that over that way, I haven't had any luck getting tarpon. Literally no no tarpon at all. definitely slowed down a bit now though but normally for the su for the sunny days we do we do catch a few but not not an insane amount until it gets to 6 a.m. once you get to 6 a.m. that's when we seem to get the unique tarpon and, and we also have a big big amount of fish there as well like anything after 6 when I say a big amount of fish, like the, an insane amount of weight overall, you start catching them a lot quicker. We will still have a few drum, I'm pretty sure of that. And some snook, and definitely more permit. That, that unfortunately, I think everybody don't like the permit. I don't think I'm the only one. As every, every person that I've fished with, I've always said they don't like the permit. Yeah, we've got some more interest. Yeah, since the patch update, definitely seems like it's a lot different. It's still, it's still good, but it's definitely different for sure. be a catfish oh well wow, one it's a permit that reeled in so so easy well I said the sunny day normally after six it picks up but it's actually not too bad starting at five and five thirty and we got 213 pound in the net that's pretty quick going considering Can. I know the bait rods are going to keep going off, but just so there's not too much downtime, I always like to always like to use a spinning rod. By using a spinning rod, keep keeps you busy rather than just standing there waiting, looking at the rods. That is when I'm like when I'm using the spinning rod now and I'm not catching. That's quite kind of frustrating. But when 
when you're not using a spinning rod and you're just standing there watching the bait rods. That takes so long. Um, I don't really know much Spanish, man. Sorry. Yeah, I, I only know English. That's a cool name though. Nacho. <laughs> I like that name, man. Oh, wow, I missed it. I strike too early. I should have waited. <clears throat> Normally, and that when normally that happens is what I would do is I'll have like a countdown when a fish when the fish comes and tries and hits it. I normally count to three seconds in my head before striking, and then strike, and then by doing that, I, you get the fish every time. If you do it too quick, you can't get it. I knew one of them were going to go off. I didn't know which one, but I knew one. This looks like a good tarpon. Not the biggest. Oh wow, actually maybe it could be. 74 pound and a half. That was quite surprising. I really didn't think it was going to be that big. It was so easy to reel in. I'm not really getting much of the uh, black drum. Most people say you use shiners for those. Which I could. I'm lost audio in that here. There you go. Yeah, I could use the shiners, but as as this stream is based on the tarpon, that's the main thing we're pinpointing. So there's not really much point in me using the shiners. I will not catch. I will not catch. It's weird because I can't catch tarpon with shiners. I've tried so many times, and I don't know why, but I just can't. But yet when, when. When I fish with somebody else and they use shiners, it works for them. They actually catch, they catch tarpon on it. Like, I don't understand how, I really don't, I have no idea. So yeah, I'm just doing something one sec. There we go. Okay, now we're good. Just checking everything, making sure the stream is going well. <clears throat> well, at least we've had the one big unique so far. A, a good size. Hopefully we can try and grab a few more. Come on. Hit that. Oh, there you go. That we got some interest on one of the bait rods. This looks like a good one. And I don't know why I did it again. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? I can't believe that. I know that I have to wait the three seconds. It's, it's, as I say, it's because I haven't played it for a little bit. <laughs> I say not a little bit. Like, I, I think... 
I think I haven't played it for like two days. Maybe three days at the most I haven't played it for. So it hasn't been insanely amount, but when you go from playing the game every day, you know, then you stop for two or three days because you're messing around doing loads of other things. I should remember, <laughs> I should, that three second rule. I created that rule. I created it myself. <clears throat> Wait three seconds and you get you get the fish. And if you don't, you'll lose it every time. Like I have a lot. That's a good day's fishing though. So far. Six o'clock, we got 321 pounds in the net. So within an hour's fishing, that's not real time in game time, just to mention. So this is with the better reel, this one. This one's with the second best reel in the game. Really good combo. I did make on the other, on my other channel, I did make a video of best bait rods and spinning rods and all of that. I probably am going to do that again for this one. I probably am going to make a couple of videos of showing what what is a good rod, bait rod, spinning rod, float rod, that kind of stuff. I am I am definitely going to make a couple of videos. So 603, and we got 356 pounds in the net. That is a really good day. Even that alone, even if we didn't catch a really big fish now, I would, I still would not mind that, just because it's, it's quick, it's quick cash, really quick cash. Good XP as well, but I am gonna need to buy more of those large minnows. They are expensive. They're worth it. You definitely get your money back in the long run, but you can burn through. You can burn through, through literally a couple of hundred, hundred thousand easy, just on those. Okay, so on the here, I think this is drum. I'm pretty sure that's unique on there, just because of how well it's fighting. But it's not drums. Not our main interest. So if one of the other rods go, I will pick up the other rod. And then we go back and then pick this one up. As long as it still stays on, we'll pick it up. Yeah, uh, this one's definitely unique on here, just because of I know how I know how it fights. It's one hundred percent. It's a unique. don't know I know it's drum I just don't know what type of drum is it red drum or is it black drum uh, I don't know so yeah as you can see I'm stopping the line from going out completely I'm not every now and again I do hit the strike button but some, it's, it's funny because sometimes I keep my finger on it all the time and then sometimes I just leave it like that and if it stays like this, the tension stays like that for too long, after quite a while, the best thing is to do is just keep your finger on the reel. Just so it lets out a bit of line. Some of these fish can be quite stubborn, so, so it can actually be good sometimes just to, just to reel, just to let it go out. Let it go out so it wears itself out a little bit. So there you go, because I let it go out. Now we're starting to reel it in a little, a little bit. <laughs> I think I'm going to jinx myself. Hold up. There's a really good size fish, this one. Them black drum do fight really hard, so it makes me think that it is black drum. But then, 
Also, the red drum fight really well when they're unique. It looks like a black drum. That looks like a black drum. Wow, we've been fighting this for a couple of couple of minutes there. Oh wow, there's my biggest. Very nice. Unique black drum. 93 pounds. I think the biggest before that was like 86 that I got. Was that 86? Yeah, I think it was like 86. That's a good size fish that. 93 pound and a half, wow. <laughs> That's real nice. 6,300 cash and nearly 5,500 XP. So, even though it took quite a long time to reel it in, it was kind of was kind of worth it. I'd probably say that some of, some of them, because I think they got to about 105 pound. So that one that one did take me a couple of minutes to reel that in. So if you got like one that was about 100 pound, that would how long it'd take you to reel that in? It probably <laughs> about the same amount of time as what it would be for a tarp. And that's that's a little bit. A little bit insane. Well, that one I didn't even wait three seconds. It just hit it, took it, and that was it. Even that, that was a 23 pound top and that gave us 1,200 cash. That's insane. That was good to get that drum though. I think the large cut bait works as well for the drum because I did use large cut bait. But I think I think just using large cut bait or shine is one of those. You're gonna you, you are definitely gonna get more drum. There you go, we got some interest again. Gotta wait for that rod to run. I honestly didn't think it was that one, I thought it was the one on the far left. I don't mind. <laughs> as long as it as long as one of the rods are going up, I don't mind. Even getting these permit, they're a pain in the backside, but they still do give us cash, so it's kind of worth it. Alright, bait. There that's um because we brought that reel, that took us down below 500,000. I was thinking, how has my cash gone down? But that's how. I definitely am going to need a lot more large minnows than 44. I will literally burn through those in no time. But I don't want to buy too many in one go because I see my cash go down. And I don't like seeing my cash going down. <laughs> I like to see it go up. I want to get all built up ready for the new update when the new update comes. I want to bring as much content as I possibly can. And the only way I can do that, or the only way I can actually make good content is by always having loads of cash. That one didn't seem like a bad size. 33 pound, nearly 34. But again, good money, good XP. We don't really need the XP anymore because we are level 55, rank two. I think I'm gonna call it for that day. I'm just gonna go to the next day now. That was actually pretty good. 536 pounds in the net. And we can only hold 881 pounds. 
I'm pretty sure if I stayed on it, there is a chance I could get that big tarpon, but I wouldn't be able to, I seriously couldn't get much more in that net. One big tarpon in there. I know I can dump small fish out, but I don't like to do that. So for that one day, look at that, that was good. 29,000. We earned some serious, serious money there, just money and XP in such a short space of time and that's not only not only it makes the, the game more fun catching them at a faster pace but to get that amount of cash in such a short time is really good. Was that the light one? No the light one's this one. I wanna keep this one I'm going to keep this one on the left all the time so I don't get it. I don't think I would get it mixed up actually. I don't think I would. Just because I, I know what it looks like now. These reels on that I've got on here, the 4000, they are good. They do do the job. But having the other ones, having the 5000, definitely is the best combination. There we go. Black drum. And I wasn't sure if I was going to get much black drum on these large minnows because I thought maybe since they're messing around with the patch update, they have changed a few things. I thought maybe it was going to affect it, but it doesn't seem like it does. You can still catch it. I think that was that rod that went off. I think it was that one. See, that's another thing, it definitely seems like, <laughs> it could be just coincidence, but it definitely seems like you catch, the rods go off a lot more when, you, when you're trying to spin or you're trying to do something. I should have picked up the other rod first. But maybe not, because this one was pretty easy to reel in actually. Oh wow, that... Look how much that... I'm surprised the rod doesn't actually fall off of the rod stand when it's... Whoa. Okay, that one's permit. Thank you for showing your... Showing yourself to me. <laughs> I think this one's permit as well. No, it's not. It's tarpon. Yeah, these permit do fight real hard. Thirty-three pound. Not bad. Look at that. That's pretty good. Considering we haven't had a unique, if we had a unique, obviously we could have had more. But hundred and eight pound just from a few different fish by five twelve. That's really good. on again so yeah I'm gonna after this stream I am gonna work on making a few different videos I've got a few different ideas of different stuff so I'm gonna work on that just so that way we got some different content I'm gonna fill this channel up now so I'm gonna gonna put a lot of time into it. The one good thing is, is because before I was jumping between two YouTube channels from one to the other, whereas if now I'm gonna be stuck to just the one. On the other one, I think I did have more. I definitely had more people watching compared to this stream. This stream is nowhere near as many people watching compared to the other stream. But I know it might take a bit of time, but I know that will change. So that don't bother me. 
I know the content that I bring for this game is really good. And I know it's good because it was because I from the other from the other YouTube channel. From the amount of people that used to always watch and the amount of comments and stuff. I know eventually it will pick up. And I should have really made a video on that on that channel saying that I was gonna make a new channel and stuff, but I didn't the problem that I was having was I didn't know what to call it. 66 pound you might as well say yeah I didn't know what to call the YouTube channel so I, I could have made a video and say I'm gonna make a new channel or I'm gonna change over to this channel but I, I didn't know what I was gonna call it so I couldn't make one I couldn't make a decision it took me like two days just to try and think of what to call it and I just I don't know I kind of liked the the bubbles underscore my way. As I say, I kind of like that. I did kind of like it. I liked it, but um, yeah. Unfortunately, it is it is what it is. I just wanted to make it easier for people when they search. Have it having the underscore. As I say, some people don't. Some people don't have that, and some people don't know how to do it, should I say. Well, not people don't have it, because I think that is pretty much on every keyboard. Or at least I've always seen it on every keyboard, but some people don't know. So, by doing it as just Bubbles Way, it's pretty similar. <laughs> but there's no underscores and stuff, so it's going to make it easier. We had to make that sacrifice. It was a big sacrifice. I probably shouldn't have done it. But, as I say, because I know I, I can bring good content. I know I can bring that good content back. It's not like that the content went bad. It was just, it was on a different channel. And it's such a shame because it really started to pick up on that. On that other YouTube channel, it really did start to pick up really good. It really did, but as I say, this one, this one obviously must have done better because it had more. So that's why I chose this. Now we got some interest on there. So we're at 529, 245 pounds in the net. That's pretty good. I'm very surprised I haven't had. Um, much interest on this spinning rod like we have we have had some but I'm I am quite surprised that we haven't got more so on this spinning rod you can also use a leader as well you can put on a mono leader or the titanium leader why didn't I wait I'd have no idea that's so frustrating that I keep doing that and I know not to do that yeah you can put a leader on but don't bother as you can see there, you, yeah, there's really no point. I'm gonna get rid of that rail as well. That'll give us a bit of cash back. We don't need that. So we've got 512,000 now. That's definitely better. I don't really like to go below the 500,000 mark at the minute, just because, just because the update's gonna be coming. I don't know, as I say, I don't know the exact date, but as soon as I know any information on the update, I'll let you guys know straight away. We'll be live streaming so you guys will know. And I'm saying that just in case anybody does come back and re-watch the stream as well. Most of you guys know I do that anyway, but just for for anybody who does decide to come back and re-watch it, or in case somebody comes back and watches it, comes back, in case somebody watches it who's never been here before. Just so that way they know that we do keep the game up to date. try and use that spinning rod. 
I don't mind that. I'd say as long as we keep catching, it's still, it makes the it makes the game good. I think that's unique. It looks like a good size. Yeah. He's got a big mouth. Look at the size of his mouth. Wow. some interest so yeah normally when I do do a stream I would normally stream anything from four to six hours but as I say I'm not gonna do the stream that long um, this time just because obviously I don't think many people are gonna know about this channel so we are gonna need to we are gonna need to push those videos out again so that way people can come across us and people can see this looks like a good size tarpon so yeah normally we would definitely stream for a long amount of whoa, a long amount of time but today I'm gonna work on putting out more videos and as I say I'm gonna keep doing live streams but they won't be daily at the minute or maybe they might be but I definitely want to get as many videos as I can 125 pound, there's another monster. Let's have a look at it like this. That is a seriously big fish. <laughs> and yet he holds it like it's effortless. Like it's not even a heavy fish. Yeah, so the live streams, as I say, I will be making them daily. If I can do them daily, then I will. But at the moment, it's not going to be a priority. Just until we can get a few people, until we get a few more people that want to watch the the streams. It's, it, it, I always say that to everybody when you're, whenever you're very first starting off a YouTube channel or you don't have many viewers and stuff. It's not a good idea, in my opinion, to to spend hours streaming with nobody watching. <clears throat> because that, that time that you spend is time that I could be, like me now, if I was going to stream for six hours and only two or three people come and watch the whole entire stream or even only come in for a little bit and then leave, it seems like it's kind of kind of pointless. But yeah, if I make a video and it's entertaining and it shows where to catch certain fish or it shows what I'm, you know, different rods and reels and whatever I'm doing, showing tips and tricks, it's definitely a better idea for me to spend my time doing that because that's how you get more viewers. That's definitely the way, that's definitely the way I've noticed it. If you spend, it's okay spending hours streaming if there's people watching. And I appreciate you guys watching now. I can see there's three of you guys. I, I appreciate you. It is not, I, I really do appreciate you guys. But I'm just saying, like, to live stream for six hours for three people, it's not really the best thing. Just because I know that by making a good quality content video, People would like that video they would subscribe to the channel and then they would want us watch us live so that's what we need to do that's what we did on the other channel this um, whatever I did on the other channel that's exactly what I'm gonna be doing on this one so we're still gonna be doing moto blogs random videos and all different types of games but for this game I need to I need to put them them good content videos back up. So yeah, I'm gonna. I know what I, I've already got a couple of couple of ideas for a few different videos. It's slowed down a little bit now, so I'm probably gonna jump to the next day after I reel this in. It's not bad though. Five fifty six, and we got four hundred and seventy five pound in the net there. Well, nearly four seven six. That's really good. In such a short amount of time, catching that big tarpon did take a big space up in the net, though. 
that's for sure. go to the next day. I'm not going to waste any more time. I'm pretty sure if I held out a little bit because it's because it's normally for the big tarpon it, on a sunny day is normally like 6 a.m. but we, because we caught that before then it's filled our net up a little bit quicker. I'm not, if I stayed a bit longer I'm not actually even going to, I wouldn't even be able to fit that much more in there. It'd be kind of pointless. So I might as well just jump forward now. It'll get us, get us catching fish quicker. And we won't need to worry about our net being full. There you go, sunny and cloudy day, that's pretty good. That looks so much better. For the sunny day, in, in, the, in the daytime and in the evening, it looks really, really nice. The graphics looks awesome. But early morning i don't know why it's always kind of like a like a fog mist misty foggy type all across the water and it just doesn't look very good the graphics on this game is actually pretty decent but when, when they when they show the fog it makes it makes the picture quality look really bad I wonder what happened to my music. It's come back. It's, it's alright. That's a permit. They fight so well now. The only thing is annoying. I just don't like to catch them just because they they take my bait <laughs> and that bait that it took that could be a tarpon. I did see a fish interest there on one of those rods. So if they go off, I'm going to put this rod down because tarpon is what we're going for. This one's not our most important. That's really giving a good fight though. They better hurry up because I'm going to grab that rod. 43 pound. I couldn't show that very long just because this one's going. If I haven't got another rod going, obviously I can show you the fish longer, but when it's like that, I don't want to lose the next the next fish. Keep losing audio. I think you can use the hash nine. That does work, the hash nine slash zero. That does definitely work. I tried putting on the nine to see if I can try and separate the fish a little bit. So I catch even bigger fish with the nine rather than the six. But it doesn't seem like that is the case. Just to mention that. So yeah, if you're going for tarpon, the the six is probably the best the hash six seems to work best oh well that looks like a good size one and um, we lagged out game there we go i honestly thought that was going to come off there there we go this is a good size one that's pretty good though we're at 5 12 a.m We've had a couple of fish already, and now we've got a good sized fish on here. That's exactly why you don't spend too much time waiting around. A lot of people say that to me all the time, you keep buying gold coins. Obviously they haven't said it on this channel, but I mean like when I was on the other YouTube channel, they kept saying to me a lot, don't keep buying gold coins, you're spending your real money, but that's... For me to keep the streams entertaining, I have to spend my own money on gold coins so that way we can keep jumping to the next day. It's got to be, it's got to be done. 
Otherwise, it's a, too much of a slow pace and people don't like that. Not as big as what I thought. 75 pounds and a half though, but that's still a still a big monster, but it's not as big as what I thought it was. So I honestly thought that was going to be over 100 pounds. But that's still pretty good though. Okay, let's see if we get a chance to use this. I see some more interest going. Don't forget to drop a like on the stream, people, if you are enjoying Fishing Planet. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new, turn on notifications when there is updates for Fishing Planet. We're going to be downloading, installing, uploading, live streaming as fast as we possibly can for you guys. Showing you all the tips and tricks, where the fish are, new DLCs, all that good stuff. There we go. I waited the three seconds that time. <laughs> Wasn't a very big fish, but I, I waited the three seconds. We got it right. Nice. I, I quite like the snook. They don't give that much money to be honest, but their mouth is kind of, I don't know why, their mouth is so big, but I just kind of like the look of them. They do look kind of nice. I do really like the striped bass as well. But for the, stri for the striped bass, it's, uh, it's okay. But we can't, we can catch tarpon, but it seems like tarpon here, it seems like they bite quicker. At this location, it seems like they bite quicker. You could also fish off the deck and you can catch tarpon there and the unique striped bass, but yeah, it's just, it doesn't seem like it's as quick. It, well, actually, it's probably about the same, but the main reason why I don't, why the reason why I think it's not as quick is because I use this rod. Because I use this spinning rod. It doesn't... When I use the popper over there, it doesn't have much luck at all. If I use the buzz bait, I do catch the odd bone fish, and I catch some of the odd drum and some other fish as well, but... Yeah, using the popper over at the other location, just, I don't know why, it just doesn't seem to, doesn't seem to do anything. Nice. Gotta love the permit. <laughs> See, even though they're... I don't know, they're just really weird looking fish. I just don't really like them, but it, it the, the way you got to look at it is it still gives you cash. That When you catch that one, that's like five more large minnows you can buy. So even though it's a pain that they, they do rob your bait, the way I look at it is they rob your bait, but you can replace five, five baits from them stealing your one bait. So... As much as they are kind of annoying, you are still you are still going to be in profit, so it's it's kind of worth it. Come on, don't slow down. Started off so well. Right, 534, we've got 205 pounds in the net. We do have a little bit of interest on the bait rod. So yeah, so when I make the, them little clip videos and stuff, is that Frank? Oh, there we go. How's it going, sir? I 
Okay, so Frank is um, he's one of our subscribers from the other channel. He's rank eight. That's not bad. Now on the on console, I think I'm like rank twelve. Anything between twelve and fifteen. I haven't played the console for a little bit. I am, as I say, I am going to play console. But I just wanted to get the... What in the world? <laughs> wow. Okay. That's kind of like a glitch. If we go like that and go back, that normally fixes it. No. What in... I have no idea what's just happened. Okay, well, anyway. <laughs> yeah, it is what it is. As long as we can still fish, that's the main thing. Yeah, so we are we are going to be playing console and PC as well. Just I wanted to get on the PC today just for the the first stream of this channel to be on PC. But we are definitely going to be, we're definitely going to be putting, putting out some videos from PS4. But I always, I'm always going to use a face cam and a mic when live streaming. But when I make those clips, I don't really bother to. Like obviously I use the mic and I always explain everything. But I don't really bother to use the face cam just because it means I have to set it up all the time. Sometimes when I'm not live streaming, obviously I'm trying to get you guys some great content. So uh, I don't have the camera on and I kind of just snack out, eat snacks and <laughs> play my game and yeah, but I had my face cam on all the time. Yeah, eating all the time, I'd have to keep moving everything off my desk. My desk is a really big desk and it's kind of filled up with a load of rubbish to be honest, but Yeah, it's still, it's still good though. It means that it's, by it being bigger, it means that I can fit more on the desk. But yeah, I don't get really, every now and again I might use a face cam for making, making video clips, but it's not very often. I will always use it for a live stream, but them short clips, I don't really see the point. Mm, I think I'm gonna jump to the next day. This weather looks like it's broken. And we are we are catching fish, so that's one good thing. But I don't know. It looks really weird. It looks really weird. We'll reel them two in, and then we'll we'll jump to the next day. Get this one. Hold on one sec, guys. I think I... Oh, okay. Sorry about that. <laughs> I brought my I brought our chat up. we're fishing with I wondered normally he comes into chat Frank normally does come into chat but he hasn't come into chat yeah he didn't come into the chat and I see that I see my steam message was flashing so he obviously um, sent me a message I think he was expected to see a notification from the from the other YouTube channel, I think. I think that's what I, he was looking for. Because he did say he didn't see any notification. Yeah, 
it's going to be our main YouTube channel. As I say, I removed the other YouTube channel. Even though there was some amazing videos on there, and they got some really insane amount of views and stuff, I still wanted to, uh, I wanted, to, I wanted to stick to one. I had to make that. I had to make that choice. I was meant to change the next day because of the weather and I forgot I probably will in a moment but I'll wait for a sec I'm not gonna reel these in just yet I did see a bit of movement just here unless uh, unless it stops which I think it has yeah I jumped to the next day. I, I don't know what's going on with the weather. It's gone. The game's gone glitchy. I'll go to the next day if it doesn't make any difference. Worst thing is, is we might have to... Oh, there you go. They, all right. I was going to say, we might have to restart our game. That was really weird. Strange. Found you. <laughs> Yeah, I haven't. I'm not using the um, the other channel anymore. This one's going to be my main channel. I removed the other one. The other one's now gone. <clears throat> it seemed like this channel was getting better, so. I come over to here. Alright, well at least the weather's not... I shouldn't speak too soon. But <laughs> at least the weather's not gone funny now. Oh wow, that made me jump. Had to go off, but I didn't see. I didn't see any notification on the screen. Did you see any notification on the screen there? Did Did you see what it said? I don't think it. I don't think it did anything. You subbed. Okay, so that that's what the noise was. You subscribed. Did it come up on the? Did it come up on the screen saying that you did? Because I didn't see it. I did hear it. But I didn't see it. Didn't see it. Nah. Yeah. Strange. I'll, I'll, I'll have a, at least now I know I'll have to have a mess around with it I don't know why it's not though let me just uh, just use the bait rods for a second let me have a look This is alert. Um, yeah. Let me let me let me see if that comes up on the screen, hold on, oh, press the wrong one, let me press that, can you hear that, or is it just me, 
don't think you guys can even hear that. No. Right, I'm just going to use the bait rods for a second. Just whilst I um, have a look at this. That's really strange. I don't know why. Mm. Show, oh well, we got the uh, the funny glitch thing again now. I think. I think I got the wrong setting for there, that's why. Hmm. I think that's what it is. The test widgets. Oh wow. That was really loud. Okay. Um Them bait rods have really died out. I'll give it a couple of more. I'll give it about another minute. If nothing happens, so then uh, we'll we'll mess around with it. Or in this case, doesn't always matter. <sighs> I think I gotta. It's not letting me click the link in. I clicked on copied. I copied the link. Yeah, I clicked on copy. I copied the link, but it's not for some. Oh well, <laughs> I have no idea what I was doing there. Yeah, it's not. It's not copying and pasting it. Can't hear anything other than music and game. I don't know why. Why it won't let me paste it. Yeah, it won't let me paste it. Well, that's um, a pain. I know I, I, I know I could obviously type it in, but for me to type it in, oh, hmm. Yeah, I can't really type it in because I'm not going to be able to. I'm not going to. I'm still not going to be able to see. I'm not going to know until someone else subscribes, so I'm just going to have to, yeah, I'm just going to have to leave it, and then uh, I'll, I'll, I'll adjust it, and then hopefully for the next stream it should be good. We keep getting this weather glitch now. It just keeps going dark quite a lot. It's going to keep doing that. The only way to fix that is we are going to have to restart our game. But <clears throat> yeah, it's because I um deleted all from the old one that I had because I've deleted from the old one I deleted the old the the old way that I had it set up and obviously now I've got it set up for this one I did technically I did set it up differently so that's probably why the way that I used the way I did set it up was the way that um, somebody else told me to set it up and I did do that and it's not working properly but the way I did it 
the way I did it before did work. I have to type in the I have to type in the whole address thing separately. I'm gonna stick with the bait rods for a second, guys. Might be a slight little bit of a downtime because it doesn't seem like when we when we're not using the other rod. The spinning rod does seem like it is a little bit slower pace, but I need to I need to quickly type this in, and the only way I'm going to be able to do it is I have to type the whole thing in. That's the only way I'm going to be able to do it. And it's really, really long writing as well, <laughs> which that doesn't help. it's so long well at least we're still catching fish that's the main thing so it's what I'm gonna do is I'm I'm gonna type that in and then see if that see if that does it. <laughs> I know you can see that there on the screen, but I'm just I'm trying to see if I can get this to work. It will be moved in in a, in a moment. Doing these things whilst live streaming is not the best thing, but by we by us doing this is is this is how we get this is how we get our things fixed. Because the things that we can adjust, we can adjust it and make it right now. So that way the next time the next time we stream we don't have these problems. Let me just move my water over there for one second, otherwise I'll uh, end up knocking it. That was such a long thing to type in. You don't you don't even understand. And yet it says seems you merged your Streamlabs account. Please re add your widget link. Hmm? What? Okay. Um That's really strange. Okay, so that didn't work. Clearly not. I would have thought me doing that would have fixed it. Hmm. I don't know what else. Um. What does it come up under us? It 
See, this time I used, I think, the alert box. That's what I used. But last time, I'm very sure... I'm very sure I used browser source. sure it was some some type of browser source that I used uh, okay I am gonna reel those rods in and we are gonna go to the next day I don't know why I'm, I'm not gonna mess around with it anymore now just because we're live and the downtime and stuff's not good for you guys. So, yeah, we'll, um, I just have to, I'll have to do it in my own time. But that, it, that is a pain. I don't know why that doesn't show up. That's really really strange <clears throat> the way I did it as I say I ended up watching I ended up watching someone else do it but it was a different way to the way I set it up the very first time the very first time the way I did it was I'm sure it was a browser source that I use I, I don't know well um, I'll have a mess around with it That is a pain though. I'm only waiting for a, an extra few seconds just because I saw a bit of movement there on top of the water. Hmm. I really don't know why that didn't show up. Do you want to click on test widgets? I click it, it makes the sound. But nothing comes up. Yeah, I hear the sound that you subscribe, but like of, of somebody doing it, but it doesn't show up. Hmm. I just want to try one thing real quick. If I go like this. Um, sign into chat. I just want to do this for one second and see if it comes up on my on my front screen because I did also have the chat thing on. Thing on so it comes up on the screen and it doesn't look like that is either and again I did that a different way as well so obviously the way that I'm doing it the way I'm doing it is not that way that way does not work so we'll not be doing that okay well at least now I know I will spend a bit of time later. Later on I'll spend some time and I'll go through it and make a few adjustments and make some videos at the same time. But I yeah, before the videos, oh no, I won't let do that. I just wasted a gold coin. I think my game's now crashed out. I was meant to click next day, and I ended up clicking forward the time. 
Oh, come on. My game's crashed. <laughs> I broke the game. Might have to restart it. I'll I wait a few more seconds. Well, that's a pain that it does that. I think it has. I think it's completely froze it. In fact, this what I might do is I might just end there so I can make some videos and make some try and get the screen the uh, stream thing going a little bit better. There's so much you can do in OBS. Yeah, there's um, there is a serious amount, man. So yeah, I'm gonna have a little bit of mess mess around, get everything going good, and uh, make a couple of videos. And as I say, we'll uh, we will be going back to live streaming every day but at the moment I, I might still live stream every day but I want to get a lot of videos out because I have I don't have many videos on this channel at the moment so yeah I want to work on that but um, I think that's gonna be pretty much it for this one and we will definitely be coming back for more live streams but um, yeah as the games crashed we might as well we might as well get some edits done and make some videos at the same time and get some good stuff up and running. So thanks everyone for coming to join us. Sorry about the the end there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's going to be pretty much it for this one. Subscribe if you're new, turn on notifications when there is updates for Fish and Planet. We're going to get them to you guys as quick as we possibly can. We will catch you people again soon with some more fun and games. I am out. Thank <laughs> you.